action. It was a cold, snowy third day of shooting for the new Saskatchewan web series Zarka, but the feeling on set was warm. All the producers, directors and writers on Zarka are women, many of whom are BIPOC. It's been such an honor to be able to be hired by another Muslim woman to direct something because, you know, we're a little bit of unicorns around here. What I really love about Zarka is it's kind of a no holds bar. It really goes out there. It's not holding anything back. And at the same time, kind of laughing, but learning about how it is to be, you know, brown and Muslim in Canada. Congratulations. I'll be there with my plus one. Brian. Zarka is a comedy about a divorced Muslim woman who learns that her ex-husband is marrying a white yoga instructor half his age. To get back at him, Zarka decides she will find a date for the wedding. Like divorce is a universal story. How does a woman feel when she feels that she's, you know, been dropped or left for someone else? And it's that feeling of, um, you know, Am I still valued in this world? The writers, directors and producers say working on a show with so many strong women is inspiring. But they say that necessary change has been too slow to catch fire in the television industry. We still have a really terrible ratio of, for example, at high levels, male versus female directors. If you fill your leadership roles with women and particularly with moms, the job is going to get done and it's going to get done efficiently. Take one, foster it. There hasn't been much television or film production in Saskatchewan in recent years. Candy Fox says that's because the province's film tax credit was eliminated in 2012. Fox was an actor on the Saskatchewan film television program Moccasin Flats in the early 2000s. It was a thriving community in the past and I think a lot of people um, would be delighted if that happened again. Nawaz says she hopes Zarka will play a role in reigniting the industry in Saskatchewan. It's been a while since Corner Gas and Little Mosque were here, but I feel very strongly that Saskatchewan was, you know, the place where it, the television industry was ignited in our province. And it was, you know, after that we saw so many wonderful shows like Schitt's Creek and Kim's Convenience. And I feel like, we you know, our province can do that again. Zarka will make its way to your small screen on CBC Gem in 2022. Laura Sharpaletti, CBC News, Regina.